right, guys. Um, you're going to have to take into account I was an idiot with this one. I forgot to uh, I forgot to turn my mic on. So what you see in there is me talking and unfortunately I realized I didn't turn my mic on. So I'm having to now go over and narrate this. Basically the issue here was I used Ryzen Master software to I wanted to do some benchmarks um comparing my 12 threads, 6 cores, with a quad core. And what I wanted to do was over, you know, when, with 4 cores, I could clock it higher. I could get 4.2 gigahertz. So I wanted to compare those benchmarks. So I locked a few cores, you know, so I had 4 cores. And then what happened is I did some benching, and then I realized my cores were stuck. Um, I couldn't get them back basically yeah um, and that's the situation I'm at now I can get four cores eight threads or two cores four threads but I cannot under any circumstance get back all my six cores twelve threads I just can't do it I've uninstalled the Ryzen Master um, I've uninstalled anything else that I was using to overclock. I've tinkered with the BIOS, changed settings, um, put them back to default. Um, God, I've tried just about everything you can do. I've changed every setting there is. Um, yeah, here's me now, I believe, about to reinstall Ryzen Master. Yeah. So here I re what I'm doing here is reinstalling Ryzen Master, trying to um, get my cores back, and you'll see what happens. I'm sure a lot of you have come come to this video. I've got this issue. I'll show you what happens. So I uninstalled it. Try you know I thought that would figure would would sort it, but it didn't. So then I reinstall it, open it up, and here you go. Now you can see two cores are disabled. And when I try to go back to get zero cores disabled, this happens. I get that there. Number of cores disabled lesser than current cannot be applied. And this is what I got, and I could not get the cores back. I could not do anything to get them back. Now, when I click Save Profile, it went green, but it would not apply. I had no way of applying it at all, guys. Um, so, yeah, this is the situation I'm stuck in. Stuck in, just stuck in this situation, guys. And um, I've tried all sorts to get out of it. So, um, yeah, what I'll do is when I figure this out, I'll come back with another video and let you guys know exactly how I solved this. Uh, if anyone knows kind of how to solve it, let me know. Um, I, I would say just don't use, don't use Ryzen Master to lock cores, just don't do it guys. Because I just can't get them back. Catch you later guys.